Hi there, I'm Teresa Panenary and once again we are back out at San Vicente Reservoir here in Lakeside where we are very excited to announce that the dam has reached its full height of 337 feet. That is 117 feet taller than when we first started. Once again, I'm joined by Kelly Rogers, our project manager. So Kelly, it looks like construction is all done. Well, Teresa, not quite. Um, although the roller compacted concrete used to raise the dam was completed last September, there's still a lot more work to do. What kind of work are you talking about? Well, work to install the mechanical, plumbing, and electrical systems is underway, as well as the computer programming. What are the computers going to do? Well, the computers are essentially the brains of the dam, and all of the other equipment is used to control water flow from the reservoir to the City of San Diego and Water Authority pipelines. So when are you thinking that that's going to be completed? That'll all be complete this year. What's after that? Well, we'll be constructing the new marina, which I know the public is really anxious to start using, and we'll be replacing one of the city's pipelines. So what makes this dam race so special? Well, this project is exciting from many perspectives, its size, its complexity, but the true value it brings to the region is the additional water storage. In the event our water supply was cut off due to an earthquake, or we faced a drought like we did a couple years ago, we could tap into the storage right here at San Vicente. So what does that mean as far as the lake level? If you look over here, Teresa, to the hillside, you will see a marker, an orange and um, white marker, and that marks out the new water level when this reservoir is filled to its expanded capacity. So how much water is being added? That's an additional 152,000 acre feet, and that's enough water for 300,000 households for a year. That's a lot of water for our drought-prone region. For more information about the San Vicente Dam Rays, please log on to our website at sdcwa.org and be sure to stay tuned to Channel H2O for future updates. Thanks for watching and we'll see you next time.